Hello, Mega Crage here. Welcome back to Jack 2. In the last episode, we started the game. In this episode, we're gonna steal a vehicle. Like, I just did. Oh, that felt weird. Because I've been playing the PS3 all day. And now, it's like, oh, that's right, the controller is slightly. No, oh, son of a bitch. My cat distracted me. Cat, stop being distracting. Because now I have to run away from the freaking guards. My phone is doing dinging at me, and now I have to run over people just to get away. It's awesome. It's not even a cycle. It's just this thing. And it's not meant for speed. It's meant for leisurely acts or to run people over because it's apparently doing that really damn well. I, I've I got like a high high score on that right now. And there's guns. There's there's no need for guns. I, I've murdered many people. There's no need for guns. <laughs> High speed. Yeah, maybe if you're walking like you were just were. Anyway, let's watch a cutscene. Because cutscenes are fun to watch. Anytime. Woo! Being a big hero sure makes you thirsty. The Baron turned off all water to the slums. He's willing to sacrifice innocent lives just to destroy the underground. I shouldn't be surprised. I've seen his evil before while serving in the Crimson Guard. That's why I quit. You were a Crimson Guard? <laughs> oh, that explains your charming sense of humor. My friend in the Guard tells me the valve to turn the water back on is located outside the city, at the pumping station. Outside the city? What about the security walls? What about the metalheads? It ain't a petting zoo out there. Peeps be getting deep sexed. Find the large drain pipe in the north wall. It'll take you outside the city to the pumping station. Get to the main valve and open it. If you survive, the slums will be indebted to you. If not, maybe we'll have a touching moment of silence in your honor. I'd like to give him a touching moment. Those be button words, Dex. No, seriously, they are. Anyway, uh, we have to go to that windmill in the map. The wheels in the map keep on directing us. I totally botched that song. And I just ran to a wall. That is totally great. So yeah, we gotta pretty much fix water. We, we are turning oil into water. We're like Jesus, but for the ghetto. And I, I yeah... I am not following any laws at all right now. I mean, I'm hovering in the no hover zone. I'm running people over. And I'm running into shit. And I stole a car. And yet they do nothing. But once I poke them on the arm, they start shooting me in the face. The, the guard, I mean, by the way. And the only reason I do this is because I don't want to deal with cars because they get in the way but people will get in less of the way the only danger about doing this is uh first of all water you know now I'm on a narrow street but now if I do this oh I'm not gonna fly anywhere and the lot guards like to walk and they're not really that visible especially when I'm using my capture card so or if I totally okay if I ever took freaking hover car school, I'd be failing right now. I, I could drive well, but when 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 it starts hovering, it, it doesn't like me. And I just made it to full screen because I, I need to be able to see with this game. And since it's not the HD version, it's just like blurt. Uh, I'm gonna punch this. Yes, indeed they are. Wow, I almost missed. Yeah, these metal heads take two hits. Uh, so these are pretty much the uh, enemies of the game taking in place of lurkers. Lurkers are in the game, but it's kind of a twist. You'll, you'll see later. It's actually kind of funny. But for now, boom. Hey, I, I press circle. You're supposed to get kicked in the face. When you get kicked in the face, you're supposed to actually get kicked in the face. By the way... Boom, shakalaka. Fifth precursor orb. Precursor orbs are as rare in this game as 
power cells are in the first game. But, I am not gonna, I'm gonna 100% this game, but I am not gonna collect everything. All you have to do is beat all the missions to 100% the game. So, oh, that was close. So you, I'm getting 100% storyline, which it's a let's play, duh, it's kind of a given. You can't do a let's play of a game, except, uh, unless if, nah, I was gonna say something else. You can't do a let's play of a game if you're not gonna fully do the game. <coughs> game grumps. Ahem. <coughs> No, I, I, I love them, but they tend not to finish games, and I tend to get annoyed. Almost if it's like a small ass game. Like, they they finish games just, but if it has any length to it, they, they give up. I, I, I heard, or I don't, I don't know about this, but they don't even claim themselves to be less players because they don't like that. They, they're just gamers playing games, which I guess could be uh, a thing but what they're doing is pretty much a let's play not as informative you know sometimes depending on how much they want to be informative or how much they like the game but really yeah they're just fucking around and they don't want to be known as let's players oh hello okay thank you for uh, not killing me and I'm talking to myself because I could kill me a lot of the times by the way, so when when your uh, dark meter thingy is for yeah, is full, you uh, the uh, dark ego that is collected doesn't automatically go to you. You have to collect it, but you get to use your dark jack powers. This game, you can't uh, do it at any time. You have to do it when it's fully charged, and yeah, at least I believe so. I don't, I, I don't see myself using it a lot unless if I really have to. And there are times where I really have to. They're not gonna be coming up for a while. But cutscene. Ah, the valve. Allow me. Don't say it. Don't even chuckle. Next time, you turn the valves. Haha, <laughs> I laugh in your misery. Anyway, uh, I believe during that cutscene, yep. What's up, you there? Uh, there's another one over there, but I'm not gonna be able to get that for another mission because then you will die if we try swimming over there. Remember the fish from the uh, first game? Yeah, same concept. Anyway. Boom! Oh, I just got hit in the face. And I'm gonna wait for this to open. I'm gonna kick you open, I swear. You're gonna get kicked and it's gonna be open. You're gonna get kicked open. And they, they do that to actually uh, load the stage, I guess you could say. Oh, uh, where the hell am I going? Uh, there's two areas on the map you can go. And one of them is optional. Actually, it's going to stay on there. But you don't have to do it to complete 100% in the story. But I'm going to go to it whenever I can because, you, well, you'll see why. If you've never played this game, you'll you'll love it. You're going to love it. So now we can press L2 and say, yay, we have dark powers. Yeah, that, that's about it. You do not have enough skull gems. Come back when you have collected more. So yeah, if we get skull gems, 
First of all, how do I shut this off again? L1. You press L1 to shut it off. Well! Yeah, you can indeed uh, steal their vehicles, but they won't leave you alone, I'm pretty sure of it. But this vehicle is really tough, but it's also very big. But it has guns. Oh, it's not as tough as I was hoping. Okay, I am going to go away now, and I will see you guys in hell. Whee! Okay, that's not, that's not cool. That's not cool, yo. Anyway, I'm going to turn. I'm turning. I'm turning. He's making a left turn. Oh, shh, guns. I just dodged that like a ball. Oh, hello, there's my turn. I just totally missed it. You turn, done. I was driving was that easy on the actual road, but no. Probably, if you did that exact movement, you'd probably get hit 50,000 times. Well, doing the donut, trying to stop yourself, but you keep on getting hit by a bunch of cars. And I don't know where I'm going with this. I, I'm, I'm just trying to create an accident scene. It, it didn't work. It didn't work too well. Oh yeah, I, I just saw the uh, James Bond movie Skyfall, and it's it's pretty it, it's pretty cool. And it, apparently, James Bond's been existent in for 50 years. It's really awesome. The slums water is back on. I'd love to see the heads roll when the Baron finds out. Yeah, I'm sure he's losing lots of sleep over this armpit of the city. We've done what you've asked. Now when do we see the shadow? When I say so. If I say so. But before I even think about it, I want you to take care of an ammo dump we've ID'd in the fortress. Lots of Crimson Guards, constant patrols. We know it's vulnerable. And the Underground needs you to blow up all the ammo you find inside. Get all of it, and we'll deal a body blow to the Baron. You're sending us in, tough guy. So what's with this we'll deal a body blow stuff? That's fine. I want the Baron to know that it's me who's hurting him. Jack is bad ass in this game. A hell of a lot more than the first one. I I think since you know he talks, like that just ups his badassness like tenfold compared to his. He he was like. He was pretty cool in the first game, and I like him, and that's like my favorite game of the series. But he is more badass in this one, just because he's more dark and has that voice, and he's not like all innocent. It, oh, this mission. I was hoping it wasn't this mission. This mission's gonna kill me. J just, just saying to you all. And uh, here's gonna be why. Uh, there's, there's a skill to it. Uh, the marker... Oh, fuck me. The marker actually stops when it's gonna sh cut Cutscene. It actually stops when it's about to shoot, so you just move out of the way. And it doesn't stop... Oh, god damn it. It doesn't stop when... Like, the gunfire doesn't stop at the marker. It continues on. Like, it's just, the, the marker's just there to show, oh god. This is bullshit, this is bullshit, I hate this part, this is bullshit. I was really hoping to do good at this part, to show that I was wrong about me sucking. But, alas, that did not really happen too well. You gotta run away from the tank? Okay, screw you. Screw you. I don't care. Go away. Okay, now, okay, yeah, the, the marker's still there, by the way. It's not just his view. But now we're up here. Awesome. And that thing broke through. Yeah, there was no, there was no stopping that. Health. I love you, game, for actually not killing me off. And what we're supposed to do is that, that simple as that. Oh yeah, we're supposed to also headbutt crates like man, like a true man. Okay, stop shooting. I, okay, I was, how the balls did that even connect? Like, I don't even get that. That was bullcrap. 
like it went through the floor programming fail. Anyway, let's punch this in the face. I just punched. Yeah, I just kicked you both in the face. I punched you and then I kicked you and then you like, oh, I'm defenseless and I'm like, yeah, you are. And then you kind of died. You're taking heavy fire? It's more like heavy kick in the face. It's gonna go Bruce Lee and you're all. I know it's a stereotype to go like that, but that's what Bruce Lee does. And sometimes I do it in martial arts. By the way, spikes. And oh, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Well, you're gonna die apparently, because I came for you, and then you died. So that's what you're gonna do. By the way, breakage. Uh, I thought uh, I thought wrong. Anyway, I, yeah, I thought there was a orb back there, sneaking. But that might be a different part. I don't know. All I want to do right now is climb, climb, and open this door. Cool, that's a security pass. We need those to get through city checkpoints. Metalheads in the city? Why are the guards giving them eco? There's your answer. Anyway, get moving. What you're supposed to do here is have that aim and not get shot. And you have to shoot that stuff right there. No. Shoot this. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Wow, he blew up two. Now blew up, blew up the other two. Blow up the other two. All you have to really do for that is to get in front of it, and it'll blow up. So, blow it up. Hell yeah. And you're supposed to get out. Just... Oh, god damn it. Is too much excitement. We need to move back to the country. That is funny. And, uh, we just blew the living crap out of that place. And off that note, I'm gonna save. And that's gonna be it for this episode. If you like what you see, thumbs up. If you wanna see more from me, subscribe. And that's gonna be about it. So. Till next time, Mega Crage, signing out.